Welcome to Misty Biology. Let's learn something new. Today I am going to demonstrate how you can use the Eppendorf concentrator to concentrate your sample. This instrument is used to concentrate or reduce the volume of sample by evaporating the solvent. Whatever solvent you have, for example methanol, ethanol, acetonitrile or even water. It evaporates the solvent and concentrates your sample. Isn't it amazing instrument? Now come on let's focus on its part so that we can learn to operate it. This is display or controlling panel which shows all the parameters whatever temperature or time you want to set you can set here. This is the container where all the solvents collect after evaporation. This pipe connects this basic device to the external pump. You can clean this container by removing the solvent from this. Now let's see how it is used. First switch on the instrument which is just situated lower left side of the instrument. You can see green light is present in the left side. Always keep in mind that you should open the concentrator whenever green light is blinking in the left side. When the vac shows the green light that means vacuum is created inside the instrument so you cannot open it. Always wait for the light to come on the left side. Inside you can see a rotor where multiple MCTs can be placed. Always keep your MCTs open. Otherwise solvents cannot evaporate and your sample cannot get concentrated. Remember to balance the rotor otherwise in long term your rotor can get damaged. Now close the lid. Before sealing I want to show you this. This is sealing ring present in the lid which helps to maintain the vacuum inside the instrument. Now come to controlling panel or the display of this instrument. You can change the time, you can increase or decrease it according to your sample. Keep the brake on, on mode. Now for the temperature you have 45 degree, 30 degree, 60 degree and room temperature option. Here the two line shows room temperature. Different modes are available depending on your sample. You can change the mode. For instance, I keep it here at VAQ mode. Now press the start button. When the concentration time is over, remove the MCTs after closing the lid of these MCTs. Here you can see the solvent has evaporated and my compound is present in the bottom of the tube. It might not be visible for you. Anyways, this is how you can concentrate your sample using this instrument. Thanks for watching.